Hello and welcome back to Junkyard Truck. Let's show that previously on. This looks like a meteorite. Now which one of you guys is Jig Casey? Oh my god, it's red green. Oh, $320. I think I blew a tire. Get us go making some advancements. Oh yeah, this trail is no match for these tires. Um, I think I might have broke something. I don't have reverse anymore. Transfer case is garbage. Oh, much better. No way. All right, now that that's out of the way, uh, yeah, the last one we broke our transfer case and transmission is shot. Well, could be shot. I'm not sure. I'm not exactly entirely sure. That was probably a bad idea to open that because I didn't realize there was not enough clearance. Let's take a look under here. Um, everything looks pretty... It looks okay. I mean, it's not great, but looks like we might need to change some things. I'm not really sure what the pistons look like. I can see the caps, but I can't see the actual pistons themselves. Man, my filter that I just... This is a new filter. I'm going to need to put like quite a few parts into this to really make it work again, I think. My carburetor looks like it could use some love. We're not in good shape anymore. Our... Where'd that go? Hello? I lost my damn freaking distributor. Did it fall through the map? Hey, at least some of these new parts are actually looking good. Oh yeah, it's in really good shape still. I mean, it is brand freaking new. It better be. So is this. The cam probably needs to be replaced, so I mean, look at that thing, ugh. I know this needs to be replaced, which I do have a new one. So we can actually just, I'm just gonna set the things that are broken out here. Not broken, but like, should be replaced. Like, I'm pretty sure this needs to be replaced. It does, it's not fully rusty, it's got some life left in it, but it's just, it's not great. It's getting to that point where it's not good, and so is this, I think. I sell those parts, hopefully, and get some money back. Ooh! Yeah, those aren't good. My pistons? Oof. God damn. Today's episode is just fixing up my truck. Head gasket? Not terrible, but I do have a new one, so... We can actually just put that over here. Okay, how do I get that piston out of there? Because it just says engine block. Okay, I'm stuck in the friggin' roof. There we go. I think I got it. Now, where'd they go off to? Piston one, piston two. Oh, there's another one. Piston four. Yeah, my pistons are not in good shape at all. Oh boy, this is an expensive job now, all of a sudden. Shouldn't have spent all my damn money on lottery tickets. Okay, well, that is everything out of the engine. It is literally just the engine block in here now. To make a list of what we need, we need, we have a head gasket. So we need a transmission. We've got a head. We need a cam. Honestly, the flywheel doesn't look bad. Uh, we need a crankshaft. We have all the gears here, so that's good. We probably could use a new air filter and we really could use a new carburetor. But other than that, I think we are okay because I'm really not sure what else other than maybe piss. Oh, we need pistons, right? The, the pistons are probably the worst thing that I have. They are so rusted out. All right, so let's load up everything in the trunk. We're basically just gonna go to the junkyard and we're gonna sell all this stuff. <laughs> and we get some freaking money for this stuff. And then I'm assuming we're gonna have to do just a crap load of garbage bags again, because I need like a thousand dollars probably to fix, to get everything I need. I wonder if I could maybe squeeze this in. I mean, it might be doable. It's not exactly ideal, but if it's good enough, it'll get me another hundred dollars. I'll just drive nice and slow. You know, this isn't exactly my uh, my forte driving slow. I'm good at driving fast and crashing into things. All right, how much money are you gonna give me? Okay, okay, okay. 250-ish dollars. 
That's in good shape. I just only have three hundred thirty dollars. Also, not really ready to. I mean, if say if he had some like decent pistons. Problem is, I need like four hundred dollars just for pistons. Right, well, I'm gonna grind trash bags for a little bit. <laughs> all right, I totaled up all the things I need. I need about thirteen hundred dollars, and I was just about to go do some more trash bags when I saw a water heater. I figured out you can actually fit nine trash bags in the car. Probably ten. You can fit two in the passenger seat, uh, six in the trunk, if you really squeeze them in there. And then I had one in the driver's seat. But you could probably fit two, but I kind of wanted to see. Okay. So. Alright, how much money? Okay, that was a hundred bucks. Alright, so I learned something new. You can actually fit uh, <laughs> washers and dryers inside the uh inside the car in the in the door so if i need to i can uh, i can do that we do have enough money now which is good to buy all our parts but i figured i want kind of want to get just a little bit over that i just wanted to get a little bit over that so that i could uh just have a little bit of a buffer okay just put the fucking bags in no i put the damn bags in the freaking thing okay you fucking idiot okay get the yeah give me my money you stupid garbage truck man If you don't like how I do it, get your own damn car and truck or whatever. And I broke my truck helping you, probably. Hey man, if we can find another one of those uh, washers or dryers or whatever, I'll grab it. Let's take a look through town, see if somebody maybe dropped one on their uh, lawn again. Imagine if it was just like a washer. It's like, it's like, hey, uh, I lost my brand new washer. It was just sitting outside my yard and looked away for a couple minutes and then it was, it was gone. Got an energy drink, a lot of money just kind of why does it stack in 400? That's weird. Can I, like, put some money... I, uh, I lost some of my money by accident. Uh-oh. Where did it go? No! I worked so hard for that! Oh! There it is! Oh my god. It stayed in the car. <laughs> I was just trying to stack them into one. Okay. Let's start at the top. We need a transmission. Anything else? We have $350. I would like to turbo the truck, but at the same time, it's like, you know, I want to get working on that other truck too. So I got to save up like three to $4,000 to be able to buy all the parts that I need for it. At least when I get a second truck, um, I'll be able to have one truck as a backup truck. All right, boys and girls. The truck is going to be fixed up soon. At least putting things back together is like really simple. All right, now we're going to screw all those in. Oh, right. I needed a distributor as well because that thing fell through the map. That's right. I completely forgot one crucial step. I never put these on. All right now we can put this on, I think. The worst is when you're doing something and you have parts left over. So it's just like, oh God, what did I miss? But at least I, I, uh, I got to it before it was too late. Where's the other one? I don't know. Where is it? I don't know which one's which, so I have to take them both off. Three, two, okay, I need number one then. I need cam bearing number one. Because I don't know where it went. I'll put what I can in. I'm gonna go to sleep. Ah, brand new day. Okay, so we need a distributor. Ah. Oh. $120 cam bearing. That's what it was. Anything else? I wanted a flywheel. How much was a flywheel? Oh, honestly, I'd rather have my distributor distributor fly through the map than to have my uh, my engine block fly, fly through the map again. So, okay. So now our cam bearing. Boom. Look at that. Everything's so clean and beautiful looking. Now. Oops. Gotta jack the truck up. Look at this brand new transmission. Yeah. 
It all started because of this freaking thing, man. All because my transfer case decided to crap out on me. I had to buy all this new stuff. Oh! You bitch! <laughs> I found my distributor! Oh! And I f Damn it! And I found my cam bearing! Oh, man. Okay, well... I'll leave all that there, I guess, on the shelf. <laughs> Damn it. Uh. Alright, well, this is the moment of truth. Oh, right, battery. That would help, probably. Truck drives. Got a bunch of new parts in it. Let's take it to the city. Take it to the town. Go for a cruise, man. Hell yeah. Oh, damn. Moment of truth. If we can get uh, past the bridge and up the hill, then I know my truck's in good shape. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's good, man. That feels good. I did it. I did it! <laughs> I fixed my truck. It took hours of garbage bags and freaking washing machines, but I did it. Now, is that turbo still sitting over here? Oh, it is. Oh, you know how tempting that is to buy that? I don't have enough money currently. Oh, damn, that's actually, like, a pretty decent shape head. All right, what's this mission? Find, deliver, crashed aircraft part. I did one of those already, and that, uh, I think was pretty decent money. Oh, wait, the aircraft part? That's when my transmission started to go, wasn't it? That's when, like, my whole truck decided to crap itself. Honestly, being in the city is kind of nice, isn't it? Oh, was that it? There it is. Bam, $171 in my pocket. Should I try doing this radio tower again? Now that my truck's actually like in pretty good shape. Yeah, it's pretty sketchy. Oh, hey, there's my stuff that I lost last time. Because I had to teleport my truck. Oh, this is so much better. So much faster, holy crap. I guess the question is, does my truck have it in it to get up the hill? Mm, not quite. All right. Radio tower's not too far from here. Hmm, yeah. Okay, so I need to hop the fence. That's right. I forgot about that. I should have brought the washer. <laughs> <laughs> eh. 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 Damn it. I should leave this here, maybe. Probably need a truck to get up there. Well, yeah, I need a truck, but I also seem to need a V8 truck, or maybe a turbocharged truck. I need a more powerful truck. That is for sure. I think before I can get that other V8 truck, I, I think I have to turbo this one. Just I need the power. This thing just doesn't have it in it to get up the damn hills. There you go. Thank you. Still don't have enough to buy the turbo. Damn. Well, I could buy the EFI thing. It's just, it's not really in the greatest shape, but it's in good enough shape that it'll save me money. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to grind out a bunch of money. And uh, in the next episode, we're going to go fix up that truck or something. Got my nice, beautiful... Totally brand new EFI manifold. <laughs> all right. Well, that's going to be it for this one. Thanks for tuning in. If you like what you saw, you can hit the like if you like all my mishaps and stuff and me losing stuff and whatnot. And uh, fixing my truck up after what happened in the last episode because, you know, things happen. 
but now that I've fixed everything pretty much, I'm glad that it's running well. But now I just need to add some more power to it because it is, it's awful. Other than that, thanks for tuning in. Hit the like button if you like what you saw. Subscribe if you want to see more of my uh, journey of fixing up this truck and uh, potentially that uh, nice tur or not turbo, the nice V8 that, you know, I guess turbo could fit because there is a twin turbo kit that you can get for it. But uh, yeah, thanks for tuning in. I'll see you guys in the next one.